Hi, I'm Anne, and I speak American English. I'm a student, and I like to read and learn about languages. Today, we will learn about the difference between countable and uncountable nouns. Try to notice the difference between the countable and uncountable nouns in this story. Some of the countable and uncountable nouns are highlighted. The countable nouns are in red, and the uncountable nouns are in purple. In winter, it's very cold where I live. There is snow and ice. Sometimes I dream that I'm visiting an island that has sand and palm trees. My friends and I sit in the sunshine and we listen to the music that plays on our radio. After that, we swim in the water. But when I wake up from my dream, it's cold, so I put on a coat and gloves and I walk to school. So what's the difference between countable and uncountable nouns? Let's begin with countable nouns. Countable nouns are nouns that we can count. Therefore, these nouns can be plural. They can have the plural endings s or es and they can take plural forms of verbs. For example, I saw three cats run. If there is only one countable noun, we use the indefinite articles a or n. For example, there is a tree in the park. Uncountable nouns are nouns that we cannot count. Therefore, these nouns do not have plural forms. They never have the plural endings, s or es, and they never take plural forms of verbs. For example, snow is cold. Uncountable nouns also never take the indefinite articles, a or n. For example, I listen to music. Now it's your turn. Click pause and choose the uncountable nouns. Task of the week. Try to write a sentence with an uncountable noun. Next time, we will learn about quantifiers. This is American English. Thank you for watching.